playing around with the graphite aquarel. Let's see if we can catch some of the high fashion here at Namta. You gotta have snazzy shoes. Same with the Albert Dura watercolor pencil, where you can make a color swatch, just a little swatch, get on an airplane. Ask the stewardess for some water, and you're off and running like that. You just kind of start knocking in various tones. Or you could just begin your drawing with a pencil. Like Samoa. And now they keep walking and moving. That's the problem with shoes. Shoes don't always sell still. This lady right here is looking right now at the very pencil that we're. Ooh, these are actually straps. Pretty cool. You see, she's got some. All cool on footwear on right now. Nice and dark, fashionably black. So I'm just building down a base right here that I'm going to manipulate. And I want a little bit of a light on the top of the shoe, so I'm going to hold off. This part right here is pretty richly black, so I'm laying it down right now like this. And then, once I get the paintbrush charged up with some water, to start turning all of this into this nice, beautiful, rich, liquidy medium. Drag it around. It also tends to fix it right into the page. And in graphite and sketchbooks has the issue, do you want to fix it? Is it going to come off on the other side? But when you do something like that, it embeds it into the paper a little better. However, we're going to show you in a minute here, once I get a once I get a little eraser, that you can work to lift it back out again. Me, I'm a guy that doesn't erase very much unless I'm trying to make a statement with eraser. But there's many roads to Rome, so some people like to be able to lighten the marks up. And there's a there are tabs. These are like a hip version of old galoshes, right? And little tabs on them. All right, so we've basically given her a little bit of a concentration of the dark up there by the highlight. See, I'm dabbing it, so I'm getting it to puddle as well as marks. Nice and loose, nice and wet, like that. And it's like a sumi brush. You can see, wet it up like this. Les boot. Is it one or two O's? Two. Two? Okay. <laughs> Le boot. If you want to scoot. And and there is something which once that dries, I can come back on top with other mediums. But here we are. Got a little fabric still eraser on me. Right here, it's a PVC free eraser. We're gonna see if we can move this once it's dry. So we're gonna go right through my L. So I could burnish out some areas for highlights, mm -hmm. just like that, let's say on her toe. Or if it's like a hazy day, the shoe has got not a distinct contour on it like that. I can do that. 